and England strike forward. Driving that ball forward again, it's the driving ball, and it's Hannah Potterman. Her first try for her country, and she's only 18 years of age. I was down the rugby club so much. I was down there on a Saturday watching my dad, on a Sunday watching my mum, and then obviously um, playing as well. So I started at Datchworth, which was like just my like small home club. And I never really got into any other sports. Like I could do everything at, at school, but rugby was just sort of like just my outlet. Like I'd met some amazing friends. It was a nice way for me to get my aggression out. I wasn't an angry kid, I'm not. <laughs> but um, it, it, yeah, it's just, I've never really had a connection with a sport like I had with rugby sort of thing. I enjoy winning so much. And the fact with rugby is that you can do it with 20, 23 other people. You've got that whole experience and ev everyone's involved in it. Here's Bottoman, Hannah Bottoman. Bottoman's over. Try awarded. I went away to Hartbury for a year. It made me not love it as much as I did when I went. Because I, when I went, I was just doing it for fun. And then when you get to Hartbury, it's training every day. And it's, it's, it's an incredible, um, set up to be in but it didn't work for me where I was in my life at that point. I came home and I just I did nothing for a year I just went to college and just did what I wanted like a normal teenager sort of thing which was what I was like adamant that I wanted to be and then um, obviously got the opportunity to play for Sarri's last year and just never looked back like I actually started enjoying it again and sort of fell, fell back in love with it. That then was sort of like actually like if I, I need to sit my head down here and, and sort of get better and um, get fitter and just try and get as far as I can. And from that comeback, not too long after that, you were then part of an England squad and making England yeah. rugby. So what was that feeling like? Yeah. Going from almost quitting rugby, getting back into it, enjoying it, then you're playing on the international stage. I still haven't really grasped the concept of what actually happened. As in like, I literally just got back into rugby and within sort of like four or five months, it was like, like I was getting my first cap for it. Like it was absolutely insane. Like amazing, like incredible. There are genuinely no words for it. Like you can't really describe it. It's just like the ultimate sort of just pride, I guess. Um, I don't think you understand it until you've done it, which is, is like, I, I genuinely, I really struggle to describe sort of like the feeling. It's just like pure like, happiness like there's no feeling like it. So that is such a special moment for any player. You have to celebrate, you have to milk it for everything it's worth because you don't score your first try more than once. What a moment for her and a bottom of the one that gets the ball over the line.